What did you do that for? I told you, love. I'd rather you didn't try and phone your dad just at the moment. Who said it was him? Wasn't it? I've a right to speak to him. He can't stop me. Oh, lovey, I don't want to stop you. But just while we get through these next few days, I'd prefer it if he were the one to make contact. Why? What difference does it make? I don't want him to think I'm using you. You're not. Were you ringing her place again? No, she told us yesterday he's not there. <laughs> That's her story. She wasn't lying, Mum. I know he's not gone there. Oh, lovey, how can you be so sure? Because this is where he lives. My dad will never go and live in a stupid old house. I bet it's full of smelly old cats. You mean he's got to start slave for the day? Aren't we daft? Oh, yes. If he does give me to Mr. Roberts, we can make you do whatever he wants. And that's like being a slave. Listen, just call us. There's only one place I want to go. We can't go there. Oh, where's that? My dad's office. Well, what's stopping you? My mum don't want me to. Thing is, we fell out. It's not so bad. My mum and dad are always falling out. It's a bit more than that. What do you mean, like, getting sort of both? No, they're not. I don't think so. I don't know. What's so bad, you know? I know loads of kids in the army with folks are split up. It's all over this stupid woman. That means he's got another bird then? It's not like that. She was just working for him, that's all. Well, if there's nothing to it, how come all this aggro? They had a row. Mum got upset and told him to go. I'm sure she didn't mean it. She's that upset. We both are. I know my dad's not happy. It don't make any sense. We know what I think. I think she give me a hand when I'm flipping you out. You were? Uh, had your half time inspection yet, or what? You don't just sweep round them in, you sweep under them as well. <laughs> you know, it's a wonder he hasn't got you polishing the drains or something. <laughs> Have you had any dinner yet? You must be joking, I know I'm rations us. I'll take it to the cafe if you like. Buy you both a burger. Got some money from Christmas. Sorry, squirt. Confined to ballots till Genghis Khan says otherwise. <laughs> Oh, she's a bit cheesed off, you know, Mum and Dad just split up. Oh, right, yeah. Oh, and I wish ours would. Wish the old fella would go back to Germany or, or Hong Kong or somewhere else further, innit? Mm. You don't mean that. <laughs> you want a bet? Anyway, my dad will be back soon. Has he said? No, but he will. He's just sulking because she told him off. All men are little boys, really. I'm going to see him in time to come back home and stop being so stupid. Well, that was a good morning work, madam. Feeling better about things? Um, well, a little more optimistic that we might actually get a paper out this week. Thanks to a certain bossy lady that I know. <laughs> Come on. You can treat me to a smoked salmon sandwich on the street. Tracy, is that you? Oh, lovey, where have you been all this time? I've been worried about you. You needn't have. Where did you go, love? Did you go to see your dad? Oh, it's all right. I don't mind if you did. I should never have tried to stop you. I hate her. Who, Wendy? It's all her fault. I hate her. I wish she was dead. <laughs> 